this is a man-powered drag. Uh, it's been run a little bit here, so it's accumulated some snow. As you can see, we'll explain a few of the features here as we go now. The drag has a top and a bottom, obviously. On the top of the drag, we have flat 2x4s so that if you have to run down the road, you're not dragging snow. It makes it much easier to pull. Also, in cases where you've got lots of new snow, it's good to run over it the first time with the flat side, otherwise the effort is really difficult. Uh, construction is basically 2x4s. These are 8 foot long on the sides, and the cross pieces are about 32 inches wide. So the overall width of the drag is 35 inches. The working part of the drag has blades on it because if uh, you don't have a lot of weight, the thing doesn't want to dig in. So I put some blades, just made out of tempered hardboard, at a 30 degree angle sticking below the rails on the drag about a half an inch. It seems to work real well to pick up the snow. Uh, you might notice the shovel here, which is used as the handle to pull the thing. And that gives a nice bearing area here, but it also gives you a shovel to use when you need to fill in some low spots. There are attachments uh, on the back of the drag uh, to put on a tracker and some weight, and uh, we'll explain those in a later video.